Uh, Mikey, you think we can do this? Big pool of Coca Cola. It looks uh, really dark. I don't think I'm doing it. morning people welcome to this new video today is the day that we are going to ride the super pathfinder that's why we are in Eindhoven in a hotel and it's six o'clock right now super pathfinders event organized by pathfinder Giro COVID proof it's basically a 320 kilometer gravel route that should be okay with our Isalcos. but you can choose whether you do it in one day or two days and we thought we would do it in one day there's still a curfew here, so if we want to finish in time, we have to start early. I'm looking forward to it. I think yeah. today will be a good route. The weather looks okay. I think we will have fun. Easy spin. Just eating. Just eating all day. Just eating. Spelling. About the bikes, Isako, both. Mikey riding 30mm Vittoria Costa Control. Me, I put in 32mm Panarese Gravel Kings, semi slick. They were hella expensive, but I think they will be comfortable. How far away from the start? I have the route, but it was the other way around. Ah, but, uh, but you made your own route? Our own route to the start. Okay, then we go there. Perfect. But Mikey, does that mean it's not a 320 kilometer route but it's longer? Pretty. And the route. 316 to go. I feel at home, Nature Mike. <laughs> But we are about 30 kilometers in, on the gravel now, it took a while, but it's really beautiful this area. Mikey, you think we can do this? A little update, we're 100 kilometers in. I'm feeling like shit, it's always on long days. And the route so far is definitely less gravelly than we expected, but it's still really beautiful. And Mike can appreciate all the road segments because he is on his regular tires. For me, the road sections are not the best. Maybe you didn't know it already, but when you have the, the route, you can check it in Komoot how much off road it is. Eh? Yeah, how much was it? One third of the route or something. Oh, yeah. These Come are on. beautiful paths. Yeah. Or road bike gravel. Some speed. I do feel like having a coffee. Yeah. But I still have to ride 60 kilometers. 60 kilometers and then I can have a coffee, Mike said, because then we're halfway. Then you do one hour and a coffee yeah. and snacks. Closed. Next. Okay. Next uh, McDonald's. <laughs> no. Where's the chicken and fries? <laughs> Second try for a lunch break. 
we're at the Akkasu Klaus, where at the last Pathfinder we had some beers. I can link to this video. And now we're gonna see if they have some food. Because I'm really hungry and cranky. Hangry. Second try, second fail. Uh -huh. I don't think we're gonna get any food today. Mikey, we are exactly halfway. One out of two parts done. What? How, how, what? how much hours? Five, five hours riding? Six? Six hours. Five. Forty-five. Are you having fun? Oh, but it's good weather today. Yeah, it was a little bit cold at the start, but now it's good. My leg is in the sun and it's feeling warm. For the guys, they, they do this on Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> I think they have a little bit more rain, a little bit yeah. more dirt on the face, but... Um, Small disclaimer. Actually, this event was held on Saturday, but we saw that the forecast for the weather for Saturday was really bad. So we decided, because we are, we don't have real jobs. Yeah, we can work also on Saturday Exa we, from the office. Exactly, so we will work on Saturday and do it on Thursday, because today we thought the weather would be nice. So far it is. We found a little bit of a snack stop. We've yeah, ridden the past 160 kilometers without seeing any supermarkets, any gas stations, any places where we can eat. This is also the first time that we can refill our bidons. So, Jorrit, next time we need more snacks. Maybe on Saturday there is a lot of snacks. Maybe he has snack stops everywhere. No, but after this, maybe if one stop now and then the rest will be riding again. Yeah. Uh, maybe one stop again. We will see. We need to I be back at I still need a eight. coffee somewhere. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and we need to be back at 8 for a focus uh, thing. Live stream. like we're on a safari in Africa, Mikey. Mm -hmm. Here's the savanna with a lake, a fence, so you don't get eaten by the lions so that are drinking. It's uh, 20 kilometers from your new house, or? And my old house, where yeah. I was born. How far did we come? 200 kilometers, but... 200 kilometers, se exactly seven hours. Can you see in my eyes how many kilometers there are left? In my eyes there are less kilometers left than on your computer. <laughs> are you I'm drinking? Crying. Drinking already. Oh. <laughs> Only 100 kilometers left, and then we are done. I heard there's a train station also in Tilburg. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. You're training. That's true. 90 kilometers to go, and we're now riding through the edge of the village that I grew up in. Shout out to Lage Mierde. Here on the right, you have the Flas, which is a bunch of really shallow lakes where we used to ice skate in the winter. Oh. Still feels like home. This town is so old school that they still use horse carts to uh, go to the supermarket. Why am I covered in cum? We share a hotel room. No. Is this no. still the same hole? S same leak. Why for, don't for you all get the viewers? Why don't you get a new tire? This is a brand new tire, my friend. Or listen to uh, the viewers and yeah. put less pressure. Less pressure <laughs> for you guys. <laughs> what What do you think about less pressure? It's only four bars in this tire. I would say three is enough. Yeah, three is enough. <laughs> Shout out! Thank you for every mechanic in the comments that knows how our bike should work. But Much think, appreciated. Yeah, I think we know. But, but <laughs> there, at the flat, it's here sealed it's, here. Here it's sealed, yeah. Is this uh, perfect? Only you... Uh, Only I'm covered in it. That's the danger about uh, riding in the wheels all day. <laughs> Not on the camera. Not on the camera. No? No. Check it myself. No. <laughs> Does the Lion King song go again? When you feel 
the love tonight. Wide-eyed wonder. Maybe better for you to just ride. Ten hours. Good training day. Yeah. Ten hours. Feeling better and better. Every pedal stroke. Diesel. Let's go. Then we are in time for the meeting. Some fries and then uh, some beers. Beers. Yes. Let's go. Three hundred kilometers done. Just entered Eindhoven again. Oh, big training day. How many hours? Eleven. 10 and 3 quarters. So the first 150 kilometers I felt really shit, really grumpy. But then we had lunch, and then it took I guess about 50 kilometers to get into the vibe. And then from 200 kilometers I felt really good. So that's something that I should remember for the ultra distance races. Because then the chances are also really big that I'm gonna feel super shit in the morning. But then there is a way that I will still feel better afterwards. Good learning point. Back at the hotel, we're going to make a quick setup for the live stream thingy. for the viewer that can name this bird that we just heard. Question. <laughs> 